everyone and welcome back to my channel. Today's video is going to be a previously promised video, but before I get into it, I wanted to say I'm sorry for being MIA for so long. I have literally been sick for the past like two weeks. Um, I have felt not that awesome and I have been coughing like crazy. Feeling a little bit better. I know I sound a little bit terrible. So yeah, um, I definitely apologize for my absence. I really hate not making videos for such a long period of time. Um, but hopefully I get better soon. Alright, so today's video is going to be about the... I wouldn't say the new craze because no one really talks about it, but it's kind of like a new like gimmicky thing, I would say. And that is the um, spray on nail polish. There are several different brands of spray on nail polish, I guess you could say. I know Sephora has like a nails ink one and I know other ones, but I decided to get the China Glaze one. I think I saw this on, I think maybe like the Today Show. Or something like that so I, I decided to get this brand um, I got two colors obviously because I was not about to buy the whole collection if these are terrible I haven't heard anything from this specific brand of spray on nail polish um, I know everyone was making fun of the Sephora one which is the nails ink one um, I haven't watched any videos on this either so I don't know how this is gonna go um, but I wanted to try it out <clears throat> Honestly, it, to me, it does not sound too practical, but um, maybe it would work for like when I'm trying to use my left hand to paint my right hand. I don't know. Um, but, you know, we'll try it out, see if it's worth it or not. Um, these spray cans are actually, I believe, $5.99 each. And then on the box, obviously, it recommends you use the uh, China Glaze base coat and top coat. And these are both $6.99 each. Um, to kind of get into some product details, um, these are supposedly 1.4 ounces of product. And if you buy like a regular um, China Glaze nail polish, not just the base coat or the top coat, it's regularly $6.99. And they are 0.5 ounces. So supposedly you get more product in these, even though they feel lighter. I guess because they're longer, I don't know, but it's cheaper and you get more product. But um, I don't really think there's that many colors that come in these yet. And I doubt they'll make more if it's not a good product, but we'll see. So I'm going to go ahead and zoom y'all in. Um, it says to start off with clean nails, which I did. And then it says to apply the base coat do um, one spray of the uh, nail polish and then do another spray of the nail polish, a light spray of the nail polish, and then top it off with the um, fast forward top coat. So that is what I will do. And I gotta say before I get any haters, I my nails are kind of short right now. I usually have them long, um, but I just recently cut them because they were too long because they grow super fast. Um, but I don't do any manicures. I don't do my cuticles. I don't cut my hair like extra skin. I hate filing my nails. It feels so gross. Um, so don't be mean. Um, but yeah, let me zoom y'all in. Okay, so this is what the box looks like. Um, like I said, it's China Glaze and it is the colored nail spray. This is in the shade Bright Blue. Um, on the side, it just has um, the instructions. Um, like I said earlier, uh, first you're going to apply the um, strong adhesion base coat on your nails. And your nails have to be clean, don't forget. And then you're going to spray the spray once and then do a light second spray. And then you're going to top it off with the um, fast forward top coat by China Glaze. And then with soap and water, you're going to wash off the excess. So let's see how this goes. So first, I'm going to be using the Strong Adhesion Base Coat. And I'm going to be applying this to both my hands. Just one coat.
All right, so that was one coat of the base coat. You can see my nails are all nice and shiny. I also forgot to mention, I laid down some parchment paper um, just so I wouldn't get the nail polish on my desk because that would make me really sad. So now I'm going to go in with the uh, colored nail spray. Okay, so here's what the can looks like just in case anyone was curious. And obviously we need to shake it well. Um, it doesn't say to do it continuously, so we'll just see how it goes. Well, that's a bust. <laughs> it has like a like an axe body spray smell. <laughs> Sprayed it once, and I'm getting like an axe body spray scent. Okay, I need to finish. This is absolutely bananas. Look at all the product I'm wasting. Okay, I'm gonna wait a little bit until I do my next hand. I'm just gonna shake it again. Okay, I gotta admit, this is absolutely terrifying, guys. Like, it just comes out so forcefully. Like, I'm scared to do my nails. Okay. Oh my gosh. Ah, it burns! Oh, I forgot I had a little cut right there. All right, well, so that's what one coat of that looks like. Cool fingers. Be cool for like Halloween or something. All right, and now I'm going to do the second coat on the first hand. I'm scared. Okay, I'm getting a little bit better payoff there. We'll see that. I'm blue, I'm a native guy, I'm a native guy. I don't even know the word, I always just made stuff up. All right, comparison. Two coats on this hand, one coat on this one. So it's a little bit of a difference, obviously. All right, now let's go and finish up um, this second hand. Oh my gosh. Like, I can't explain to you the feeling of how terrifying it is to spray this. Like, I don't know, my whole, the whole room is like smoky and it really does have like an ax scent or like, like a body scent. Like it doesn't smell like nail polish. I don't know. But here is two coats on each hand. These are my thumbs. This one burns because I have a cut on it that I forgot about. Great. All right, the next step says to apply the fast forward top coat. So I'm going to do that on both hands, just one coat. Okay, so I just applied the top coat. My hands look like octopus tentacles. Anyways, I just applied the top coat and just have to wait for it to dry. But here is what my nails look like before I wash them. Um, I mean, I think it's kind of cool, like having my fingers all metallic blue. Um, I'm kind of weird. I mean, I wouldn't wear this like in public, but you know what I mean. And then here is the mess that I created with the spray can. It still feels like there's um, a good amount in here. Of course, it did get a tad bit dirty from me um, holding it with my other hand to spray it, but I mean, that's okay, I don't really mind. Um, but it's, I mean, it's a really nice color. I wasn't expecting it to be so metallic. But I think the top coat has dried already, 
So I'm going to go wash off um, around my nail with um, soap and warm water and I will come back to report the final results. Okay, so this is the final product with me washing off the excess paint. Um, I'm not sure if you can really see it on camera, but there is a little bit of like blue sparkles or like reflect on my fingers. I don't know. Um, but I will say the hardest part is getting like in the insides of your nails um, to get the excess off. Um, but other than that, I mean, I feel like the, the nail polish looks pretty even. I don't know. What do y'all think? All right, so that is how that spray worked. Um, final thoughts. The color is really beautiful. I do really love the color. Um, it works. Obviously, my nails are painted, and I do feel like it's an even coat. Like, it doesn't look all choppy or bumpy or anything like that. It's even. Like, it's just smooth. Um, the only thing I would complain about is obviously it's really hard to get like in the sides of your nails and that's one thing that drives me nuts when I paint my nails and I forget like the insides. Oh my gosh. It's like one of my biggest pet peeves. Um, but other than that, I mean, they are pretty fairly even. Um, maybe some need to be a little bit darker than others. Um, I don't know, but I mean, it does work. Now, if I think it's practical, not really. Um, it is faster. I will say that it's faster than painting your nails, and it was a lot easier um, just spraying with my left hand instead of having to paint it because I have a hard time painting with my left hand, obviously. Um, but I will also say that washing it off was not hard at all. Um, I basically just like placed my hands under the water and it a lot of it already had come came off and of course I added you know soap to get the rest of it off um the tougher spots off but it was fairly easy I was really expecting it to be really hard to take off um, maybe if you leave it to dry really a really long time it'll be hard to take off but it was very easy to wash it off I was actually really impressed about that I was not expecting that um, but like I said earlier, I do feel like you lose a lot of product from spraying it and spraying it to me was really intimidating. I had a really, like, I was, I would get scared to spray it because it comes out like so like hard, like it's a, it's a good, it's a good sprayer. So it comes out fast and like hard. So you really have to be able to move, um, quickly um but I mean it does work uh I personally love the color it's sparkly it's metallic um the only thing like I said I would not like about it is the the inner parts of my nails I mean for the most part I got most of them but um others I didn't and that kind of drives me insane um but yeah um, I'm not too sure how long it'll last. Um, that's probably another gimmicky thing about it. So I'll probably have to check back in in a different video to let y'all know about how long more or less it lasted. I don't really feel like regular nail polish lasts that long regardless. So yeah. Um, but I mean it works. I'm honestly shocked. I thought it was going to be all like I thought it was going to be super patchy and super bumpy and super ridiculous but I'm impressed I don't know maybe it's just the brand um, China glazed because I know that I saw um, on Sephora's snapchat uh, I saw them dem demoing out the nails ink one and it was laughable I was like is this a joke like why did they post this it looks awful but this does not look like that at all um, I'm not a professional nail painter so it it looks like I painted my nails like it it's nice so I mean hopefully it'll last a long time I really hope it does but like I said I will check back in a different video once again each can of the nail spray yes it's called nail spray is $5.99 and it doesn't really come in that many colors I know it comes like in silver 
uh, like a magenta, this blue one, a purple one. I'm not too sure what else, but I got this at Sally's Beauty. Um, maybe you can go on their website to check out if they have different colors. I'm not too sure. I don't really remember. Um, but I will link that down below. And the uh, Strong Adhesion Base Coat and the Fast Forward Top Coat that I used are both $6.99 each. And they are both from China Glaze as well. Um, these are the ones that they recommend you use on the box. And that is what I used. So, yeah. Um, in all honesty, I'm impressed. I am impressed with this product. Um, like I said, not super practical, as in like wastefulness wise, but I'm impressed. But yeah, that is it for my video today. Um, make sure you go watch my last video um, to enter the giveaway that ends on the 13th of May. So definitely hurry up and go enter that. And if you haven't already, please subscribe and thumbs up this video if you feel like this was a decent product to review. Um, but yeah, that is all for this video. Thank you guys so much for watching. And until next time, stay golden. Bye. <coughs> George.